yo, you should check out this new series. It's called Spy Family. It's crazy. It might already be in my like new top 15. Really? I watched the first few episodes and I thought it was overhyped mid. So I'm sure that every single Saturday, whenever you're scrolling through your feed, seeing people talk about the newest episode of Spy Family, these are the two arguments that you see people saying. You got half the people saying that the show's overhyped, not that good, not that deep. And then you have the other half of people saying, wow, this episode is better than last week's. This is a top 15 anime of all time already. I kind of lie somewhere in the middle, a little bit closer towards it's a really good uh, show. I haven't read it at all. But today, I'm going to do things a little bit differently. Normally on my channel, it's me and my little brother talking about anime and manga. We're two people that read and watch that every week, and we stay very relevant with it. My wife has gotten into Spy Family and loves this series to death after just four episodes. On top of that, she's actually started reading the series. So today, we're going to interview her and see her perspective from the outside in of somebody that doesn't necessarily watch anime and has never read manga to now she reads this manga and watches the episodes weekly and is damn near begging me to watch it. So without further ado, let's get into it. We out here. <laughs> All right, so the first thing that I wanna ask you is, tell me what you think Spy Family is about. Spy Family? <laughs> oh, by the way, she has no idea about anything I'm going to ask her about, but I just want you guys to see how excited she is to talk about this series <laughs> as somebody that never really watches anime slashes ever reads mangas. So tell me what you think Spy Family is about. That's such a good question. Um, I think Spy Family is just about people kind of finding their place in unique circumstances and just kind of like banding together. I feel like it's the classic misfit story, but they all really care about each other. And I'll just be interested because like right now, none of, them, none of them know each other's identities. So it'll just be interesting to see how like this series evolves as they become like more authentic and less guarded with each other. And I think it's just about like wholesome cuteness. I mean, Anna's facial expressions, I mean, they are better than mine. So that's saying a lot. Okay, okay. <laughs> now, for those of you who also don't know, she has never once read a manga in her life. <laughs> but after we watched the first two episodes of Spy Family, she immediately said, I wanna read this series. And she logged into my Viz Manga account and has been reading ever since. What chapter are you on now? Oh, I went like 17. So, <laughs> with that said, what made you want to read this series? After you've seen me watching so many anime since we've been together, seen me reading so many manga, you bought me Tokyo Ghoul. Like, what made yeah. you want to read Spy Fan? Uh, I feel like the characterization after the first two episodes of just Anya and Lloyd were so good. And honestly, I was laughing out loud at the series, and I will be laughing out loud at the manga. And I think that says a lot. Like, I'll be a little weirdo reading it alone, laughing out loud. So, yeah, I just think how engaging it is and just funny. <laughs> and that says a lot. Who's your favorite character in the series and why? Anya, obviously. But you have to say why. She is so funny. Like, just the way she just be... She, she doesn't... She's not doing it intentionally. But the way she just messes with her mom and dad is so funny because she'll just be always like saying things that she's hearing in their minds. And it's not like manipulative, but Anya is the star of the show. Like Anya is, re Lloyd thinks he's in charge of the spy mission, but it is Anya. <laughs> Anya is running the show. Definitely. And like, it's funny hearing your perspective coming from the outside and talking about the show because there's like, Whenever you go on social media, everything's like split right down the middle. Like middle, mm -hmm. it's like half the people are like, "I love this show. It's so wholesome and cute. Like it's just a fun show to watch." Yeah. And then you have this other half of people that like watch the show, but we're expecting something that they're not getting, I guess. Those are my And they're my calling people. the show overhyped. And to me, it's so weird to call the show overhyped, especially since you don't even like anime like that. Yeah. For you to come from the outside in and watch it, and truly like yeah. this series brings you into like anime or mm -hmm. into manga 
I feel like that's something that people should appreciate. Like, it's very hard to get people to come mm -hmm. into the culture in the first place. So the fact that like a series like this brought you in, and it's just a fun watch. Like, people get mad, I think, because it's not like super deep. Mm -hmm. It doesn't have like some crazy backstory. Yeah. Like, it's just a fun show to watch. For you, it's fun to read mm -hmm. and watch. So it's like, I feel like sometimes you just gotta appreciate a show for what it is. Like, it doesn't have to be super deep. It's fun. It has good yeah. music. Um, all the characters are fun. I'm literally mm -hmm. laughing out loud every Saturday <laughs> when we're watching episodes. What, what what else do you think about the show? Anything else that you want to add to it? Um, well, Dalton doesn't know about this, but we also have a corgi dog. Um, I don't know if Mac has been featured, but she's really the star of the show. And this just says everything as to why I'm obsessed with the show. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> And Wait. that is Jen, and this <laughs> is our dog, Mackie. Go watch Spy Family. That's true. I've only, the only other show I've liked as much as Spy Family is Avatar, The Last Airbender. Basic. <laughs> Yo, thanks for tuning in to our video. If you do like this Spy Family content, let us know in the comments, but down below, leave a like, subscribe. Tell us what other content you want us to make. Like I said, she reads the series quite literally. I only watch the series weekly. So let us know what you think. Other than that, 